Hi everybody, this is Kefren. Today I'm gonna show you uh, some trick to get like uh, better performance when you're playing Apex Legion in Tryhard mode. Uh, and also what kind of like uh, setting that you should use because if you don't care about like the image quality You just want performance pure performance even if you have a good computer I will show you what to change first of all I want to tell uh, you guys make sure that you're doing if you have an Nvidia the latest uh, driver update uh, It's supposedly it, it fixed a crash on Apex if you have an RTX uh, Card so make sure that you did that also remove all those overlay that you can use origin overlay discord overlay uh, Nvidia GeForce experience overlay make sure that all uh, Those overlay are, are, are at off and also really important game mode Make sure that game mode is off game capture is off. You don't want to use any overlay when you play this game So now inside of the game first of all then you make sure mouse acceleration Put this one at off. You don't want acceleration when you play FPS game. Also, make sure that you're using raw input with your mouse so you don't have some acceleration uh, with Windows. So make sure that everything is at off. For sensitivity, uh, it's personal preference. It will depend the number of DPI on your mouse and your sensitivity over here. Um, what can I tell you? Don't go too high with sensitivity. Uh, if you do some tests, like when you see an object or something, you, you want to aim it. If you go a little bit far, too far, it's because you have too much sensitivity. So lower it a little bit and don't go crazy when you lower your sensitivity. Just do it a bit, like 0.1 per game, 0.1, 0.1 uh, until you, you, you think yeah, it's good for you and you feel good with your sensitivity. So now, graphic parameter. Make sure that you're playing this game in full screen. Honestly, borderless, uh, window mode. I saw a couple like of stuttering and stuff like that. Make sure that you're playing full screen. I'm playing native, so this is depend on your uh, monitor. Full HD for me. Uh, if after all the change or the other video that I did about boost FPS, you don't you don't get your 60. Uh, for sure, you will need to lower your resolution and play something like 720p. Field of view. Uh, field of view, don't go too crazy with this one. 110, you will see that uh, it can uh, some stuff can look weird in the game. So make sure that you're playing between 90 and 104. Uh, so depending whatever you, you want. So if you prefer to have more field of view, go with 104. Uh, 104 is pretty much the maximum that you can uh, use if you don't want to screw up uh, your game. Sometimes you get like weird uh, fish eye and stuff like that. So make sure that you're at max 104. Uh, V-Sync disable this. You don't want any input lag when you're playing. Make sure that you have some, some kind of anti-aliasing. So TSAA here. Uh, when you remove anti-aliasing and you look at uh, the map, uh, you will see like sometimes aliasing. It's like it's kind of like line breaking. And sometimes you're like, is it someone who's moving or not? So make sure that you're playing with TSAA. For the texture, uh, normally when you have 8 gig of RAM, uh, uh, 8, 8 gig of RAM, 8 gig of VRAM, uh, you will just, oh, I'm gonna go f uh, all out with this one. Honestly, this game had issue with the VRAM, just go a bit lower. So for me, I have 8 gig, I will play at 6 or even I, honestly. So if you have 8 gig, go at 3. Make sure that you're just like under a bit uh, because it, it was causing me uh, stuttering when I was uh, playing uh, the video games. And I have an RTX 2070. Uh, texture filtering always go a little bit uh, under this one so for example if i'm going here with the 3 gig go with 2x tree linear if you go low and just follow whatever you put there it's because you probably feel okay with it for sure if you you have your 40 fps and you have another if issue because you don't have a lot of vram uh, don't go too crazy over here ambient inclusion disable this sun shadow sun shadow detail everything at low spot shadow detail i'm playing at low you can test low and uh, high versus low depending on your uh, uh, computer but for me i don't like the impact of it so uh, i'm putting it at low everything else volumetric lightning disabled dynamic spot shadow and I'm, I'm disabling this and after that model detail effect detail impact mark and ragdoll everything is at like medium except this one because they don't say uh, medium i'm putting at low the impact marks so uh, that's about it for the graphics settings. This is mine, what I'm using. I'm getting like a 144 uh, FPS constant, no drop, everything is stable. Uh, you can look at, at uh, all different uh, other streamers or even players on pro settings. Just uh, Google pro settings and you will see 
what they are using some people are putting everything at low some people are putting everything at high but also look at their rig sometimes they're using two computer like uh, a computer with a 2080 ti and a, a streaming computer so um yeah just look at their build before uh, doing the same thing so that's about it guys if you have any questions just come in in the youtube section post me your rig so cpu gpu and ram i will try to help you the best that i can and don't forget to subscribe peace